Hello friends, today we will discuss about a list view and grid view in a flutter. Uh, so I have created a sample project. You can see the boilerplate code here. Um, here uh, a method main and uh, uh, my app and uh, nothing um, other things. I have just a home screen here. Uh, which I am going to extend it with a home and uh, here you can see a home screen so in a home screen I have only a container which I have going to change into a scaffold so that we have some good and nice UI there so you can see the screen is white here now what I have to do I am going to write the app bar here and in app bar what I have to do I am going to write a title here um, you can see the title and uh, after the title I'm going to write the text and text I will write at least view and grid view okay so you can see the title uh, is appearing here and the app bar you can see I'm going to to center this app bar by writing center title is equal to true so you can see the title is in the center so this uh, whole line is uh, in a one line so what I have to do I'm going to um, uh, cut this line into other lines so I'm just going to uh, write here a comma and a comma here so you can see it is converted into multiple lines okay so now what I have to do um, first of all I am going to create a list here list uh, named as like fruit name and uh, uh, the list is created and I'm going to uh, make some fruit names like apple like uh, banana like uh, strawberry strawberry like uh, guava um, I'm going to call on this so this is a simple uh, list here you can see and I'm going to create now in a scaffold I'm going to write here a body and in a body what I have to do I am going to write a list view okay so a simple list view that I'm going to use here in a list view what I have to do in a list view, list view is just like a column uh, for a time being. Uh, what I have to do, I'm going to write a children here, and in a children, uh, just like I'm going to create a card. Okay, so you can see uh, in a card, I will write a child, child named as a text, and text some data. Okay, so. Um, you can uh, see a simple uh, card here i am going to pad it with a widget uh, padding so we have some nice card so this is a little bit good uh, but if i will write here a 15 uh, then it will be more good okay in a card i will uh, set some color colors dot pink so you can see the color is here and uh, now what I have to do I am going to copy this paste this uh, again uh, paste this and uh, what it is saying maybe I am I have putting all the card uh, into uh, one card so this is not a good approach because the parenthesis of uh, this card will end here so i'm going to copy this and paste this four times okay so you can see i have a card with four items so uh, now what i have to do i am going to show uh, this list in this card okay so uh, for this uh, in a text what I have to do, I'm going to write the fruit um, name 
but uh, fruit name is not a, a string and the text uh, returns the string so what I have to do I am going to a fruit return this fruit name as a list here write a zero so you can see the apple is the index number zero uh, is the apple so you can see I have write the apple here what I have to do now um, I will write the index 2 here named as a 1 and you can see uh, banana shows here uh, I will repeat this step here and write the two index numbers and here again index number is 3 so you can see our list with index values are shown here nice uh, but um, for this we have to if we have a data of thousand values in a list we have a thousand plus values so we have to create the card for thousand times and the code will be uh, ugly okay so what I have to do uh, the other solution the other tricky part that I am going to done here I am going to remove all these cards from here and what I have to do I am going to show all the data in a single card for this uh, for this I am going to remove uh, I'm going to cut this card for our time being and in a children I'm going to remove these uh, brackets too and write going to write the name here a fruit name dot map okay and uh, I'm going to map this but we have to convert into the to list so uh, now but I have done uh, I'm I have done the fruit name the list name dot map and to map the things I have simply this is the variable that are going to use whenever we are going to uh, we are going to display data of this uh, uh, list okay so what I have to do I am going to uh, cut the null here and paste the card here so now uh, let's restart our app and check what it happens so um, um, okay so there's nothing uh, showing here why because we have a variable e here and we have to use this so here write just e what's happening there let's restart this again but uh, it's not working as we are expecting here let's stop this and run this again to see some effects let's run by pressing f5 so grill task is running our debug console is running uh, let's see so you can see our data is showing here by using just a single card so um, I hope so uh, you have understand it well now I'm going to use uh, I'm going to display this data in another way like um, I'm going to um, cut uh, this list view and using another list view named as a list view dot builder okay so uh, here I'm going to build something like in item builder uh, it takes two parameter first one is context and second one is in text okay and uh, it will return something like return and uh, return I'm going to returning a card that we have used 
uh, now run the project again it's showing unlimited apple 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 uh, so now what we have to do we are we have to restrict uh, this list view just by writing item count and the list count dot length and here you can see only four items shown but uh, in a fruit name we have passed the zero value i'm not going to pass the zero value i'm going to pass the index here that we have declared here and now right the save button you can see apple banana strawberry and guava okay uh, so uh, this is these are the things now um i am what i have to do i am going to convert this uh, list view into a grid view uh, in a grid view what i have to do i am going to write here a grid view simply i am going to write here a grid view but it takes some additional parameters named as a grid delegate sliver grid delegate with fixed cross axis count uh, this is a um, a huge method uh, which controls some uh, axis and which controls some other things like child aspect ratio the ratio of a cross axis to the main axis extent of each child cross axis count uh, cross axis count i will write here at two and you can see here okay so you can see the uh, the method uh, the ui change here in a grid way okay so uh, these are the things uh, these are simple things that uh, we have mentioned and this is not a, a tough job for all of you okay um so um, if i will not um, i will not use here a card i will use a container container now so you can see as the container does not have any padding but the card have so to remove these type of things we have a main axis spacing here and i will write here a 20 the main axis spacing so you can see the horizontal spaces add here and for cross axis spacing we will write here a 20 again so you can see the spacing uh, comes on the vertical side too okay so to add some padding i will write uh, i will wrap the container with an other widget named as a padding so you can see some padding also applies okay now uh, in a container we have some uh, other additional properties uh, like uh, a decoration and i will write here a box decoration and in a box decoration i will i have a border and there are a lot of properties you can use this but i am going to use in this tutorial a border radius dot circular and i will write here a to and t so you can see the border will be a little bit uh, okay so it says color equal to null uh provide both a color and a decoration it's mean you cannot use both color and a pro and a decoration box decoration in a, a single container so what i have to do to remove this i'm going to cut this color and paste it here now let's rerun this app so you can see we have some uh, rounded border of the container and uh, if uh, I am going to center this text we have two options first one is alignment and write alignment dot center okay so first is this option and the second one is to wrap with this text uh, in a center so the same options so that's it for today i hope you understand this you can explore some other things on a list view and grid view um, but for initial uh, you have understand this concept well so thanks for watching
kindly subscribe this channel and press the bell icon.